Okay, Don Monroe here. I just had a request to take dates like this and change them into a format that looks more like this. And so I started a couple of ways to try to do that. I thought, well, maybe if I typed it in, maybe I typed a couple, maybe it would flash fill for me, and it did not. I thought, well, maybe if I take that and fill it down, maybe it would pick up on that. And look, it's it's not um, doing that correctly. Like that does not match that. So I also thought, well, let me come into the data tab and try the flash fill using this one. And this one got the closest there, but it still it did not keep zeros in all the places I might want. Like I might want this one to say um, zero for, oh, that's still not right. That's not right. So we don't want that. All right. So undo those. Let's take a copy of this copy, paste it over here, and let's give ourselves some space here. What I'm going to do is take this and go to the data tab. I'm going to change the formatting on this. I mean, you could try it here. You could go in your date formats. Um, it's showing short date. You can get into more number formats and look at what you have available in the date. Now, you could do something like this. And that is getting closer, but I don't think that's what the request was. I think they wanted it all numbers without any dashes or spaces in it. So I'm going to get back in, date, more number formats. I'm going to go down to custom. And in here, it has that one I'm sitting on right now. I'm going to go ahead and edit out the dashes and things and see, will it give me year, year, year? month, month, day, day, in that format all the way down for those dates, and OK. And what I liked about this was that it's still going to be something that it's going to recognize for sorting, see old to new, new to old. So that tells me that it's doing a date rather than uh, large to small, small to large if it was a number format. So I'll go um, old to new. I'll expand. It, tell, it thinks I'm doing rows of stuff. So I'll go ahead and expand the selection. So we can see that it did do January's first and December's at the end. So it's still recognizing that as a date format, which I think is going to be real important. Okay, friends, hope that helped. Don Monroe, be sure and subscribe.